Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Alex. And Tim. And you're watching Rerance! And we want to make our predictions for the Elimination Chamber match. Next coming Sunday. this Coming up this Sunday, a week from today, May 31st, 2015. And we want to talk about the IC title match. Oh, it should be a hell of a match. It's between the truth will set you free. In other words, Archer, if you didn't get that reference. Versus Sheamus, you look stupid. Versus Burger King Barrett, or maybe it's just King Barrett, <laughs> versus Feeny Moore right back at Burger King. Not, not really. Versus I want my ices cubed, not crushed. Right? Crush. Rufus versus the show stealer Ziggler, Dolph Ziggler. Yeah. Wow, this should be a hell of a match. What are your thoughts? Rusev crush. And it sounds like someone wants Rusev to win. Yes. How come? Because he already had the U.S. title. Now it's time to get the Intercontinental title. Then after the Intercontinental title, get the World title. I see. I see. He would, you really think he, he'll he could win get the World title someday? Would, he could get the Tag titles someday, but who would they team him with? But I, I have no him, idea. But I want to see him get the Intercontinental title. Just get every title. I never knew you were such a big fan of his. Well, I'm a heel now, so... Oh, okay. Yeah, there, there I guess that makes I sense. put it in our last episode. You know... <laughs> Hashtag Heel Tim. I'd like to see Ziggler win it back, because the thing is, is that... Yeah, he's won it in the past, but, I mean, he's never really had a long title run, in my opinion. And I think that would be kind of cool if he won it again. I think it would also be cool if R-Truth won it. Because, I mean, he hasn't really been relevant in a long time. I mean, he appears here and there. But, I mean, for the most part, he hasn't been a major part of the show. So I think that could be interesting. And uh, I could see hit our truth retiring somewhat soon in the near future. So why not give him a title? It would be interesting. But I doubt that would happen, though. It's going to come down to Rusev and Dolph Ziggler and then the match and... It's going to have be Rusev beating Dolph Ziggler. What about Barrett, though? I mean, Barrett's been feuding with Ziggler, so I could see it come down to Barry and Ziggler, possibly. Yeah, I mean, you have a good case there. Since he lost it at WrestleMania, and now that he's King of the Ring, he can go from being King of the Ring and Intercontinental Champion. Yeah, and off. also, I mean, Sheamus it could possibly, too. I mean, Sheamus has been feuding with Ziggler as well. So. Sheamus just needs to go away. He's he looks stupid. Sucks, so. He looks stupid. Even though I'm apparently. happy he's a heel, it's just stupid. I'm happy he changed up his character, but he looks stupid if yeah. if I haven't said that already. Or they have the old look and still be a heel. I don't know what they're thinking. At least they're trying to do something different with him, I suppose. Yeah. Uh, and then you got Ryback. I mean, I like Ray but Ryback, but... I don't think he's going to win. I mean, he. It, it just seems like he hasn't won a major match in a while. I'm just glad Bray Wyatt beat him at the last pay per view. Yeah, so I mean, that was cool. And that was odd feud. But, anyways, yeah, Ryback hasn't won anything major in a while. And it, it feels like, to some degree, the WWE. Yeah, they put them in this match, but they're kind of brushing him aside as far as him getting wins is concerned. So, I mean, I'm not saying he's nec he's not a jobber by any means, but he's mid-card at best right now. Rusev. The call goes down to Rusev and Ziggler. And since Ziggler's doing a thing with Lana, trying to get into Rusev's head, that's going to actually cost Ziggler, because that's how it always works. Good point about that, actually. Once the girl gets involved, <coughs> she's just trying to, you know, get him to get the drive back. He's done with Cena. Thank God, because I was so sick of that feud. And now, All of us were. <laughs> and now we're going to get Rusev and Ziggler, and hopefully Rusev will get the Intercontinental title. So, let us know your thoughts. Um, yeah, I'm going to go with, I could see Rusev winning it, but I'm going to pick Ziggler. Ziggler all the way, baby. It's good. Those two are going to be the last two, so one of us has got to be right. <laughs> so, if Unless if the WWE throws us a curveball. Yeah. Which I doubt. It's too bad Neville's not in there. That would be cool. Or Bo Dallas. Yeah. So anyways, let us know your thoughts on that match. And we also want to talk about John Cena versus Kevin Owens. What do you what do you think of this match? <laughs> Owens. 
I mean, I hope Owens destroys Cena. I mean, why would they have him go against Cena and then lose his first big match on WWE pay-per-view? Cena almost never loses, though. Yeah, well, I'll just have Owens destroy him. I'd like to see Owens win, but I think Cena's going to win. Yeah, probably right, unfortunately. I mean... But I'm going with Owens. Fight, Owens, fight! It is an interesting and exciting time for Owens right now because he's in the middle of transitioning from NXT to, to the WWE. So Plus he still has the NXT title, and it's not for the U.S. title. So, so, so I mean... Feud. I mean, I guess if Owen does, Owens does beat Cena... It is possible just because the title's not on the line. Plus, Cena's been winning so many matches, he has to have at least one loss. Exactly, exactly. That's and cool. this would be the time for Cena to lose since the title's not on the line. But even still, I still don't see Cena losing. I still don't. I mean... Yeah. I mean, Owens... That would be amazing if Owens won. But, I mean, Owens just got called up to the WWE. So, I mean, I can't see them... Giving him the win right away over well, Cena, you called. would think they would build it up a little bit more. He's not fully called up. He's just well, like, maybe not officially like called he's up. He's still but NXT, like he's still the NXT champion, and Samoa Joe just showed up. So you know those two are gonna feud soon after he's done with Finn Balor, which I hope Finn Balor would beat him. But then again, I want to see Owens and Joe for the NXT title. That'd be awesome. But yeah, I mean, imagine if Owens beating Cena, imagine what that would do for the NXT championship. You have a guy down at NXT defending the championship who beat Cena. Yes. That would be pretty cool. That would be awesome, and I hope it happens. I hope that Owens gets a big, huge push. I hope he gets a big pop when he comes out, because when he first came out of NXT, he got a little bit of pop, but I want it to be thunderous, like what you get in NXT. Exactly, exactly. So, yeah, any last thoughts? Fight, Owens, fight. Cena, sorry. Well, you know, Owens probably won't be seeing Cena. That's my prediction. Uh, Owens will, Unfortunately. Owens will wipe the floor clean with Cena. I'd like to see that, but I don't know. I just got this feeling that it's not going to happen. Yeah. I think... It's nothing I, personal, John. I just want you to know that, because I don't know if you watch us, but maybe you do. And if I ever do meet you, I'm sure I'll be marking out like crazy. <laughs> I think uh, I think it's going to be a close match. I don't think I think Owens is going to lose, but they're not going to make him look weak. Exactly. Because they, they can't make him look weak. Because he's NXT champion. Yeah. So let us know your thoughts. Do you agree with us? Disagree with us? Uh, please like our Facebook page. We're growing as of this... Date, May 24th. 161 likes. Woo! Woo! Woo, woo, woo! You know it. Wait, did I do the Zack Ryder thing? Uh, whatever. You did like a mix. <laughs> Anyways, uh, follow us on Twitter, Ray Grants. Please subscribe. We really appreciate it. And uh, our following's growing. And we're very passionate about what we're doing. It. What we're doing. Uh, Definitely. We have a lot of fun making these videos. And uh, we love our fans. I mean, we don't know them personally. Maybe, maybe I should I don't say. I feel with them. <laughs> but we like our fans. Let's put it that way. So yeah, thanks. You're watching Ring Rants. Ring Rants.